Hey everybody, this is Dave and today's tutorial is going to be about how to jailbreak your uh, iOS 8 device uh, using Pangu. And Pangu has been updated and Cydia has been updated and now you can install Cydia right on your iOS device. You can use any one of these devices here, listed here. And the link uh, will be in the description to this website. You download it for Windows. Unfortunately, there's not a Mac version yet, but I'm sure there will be. And the good news is that now uh, there's no need to SSH into your uh, iPhone to install Cydia files. You can basically just run this app. And uh, it's been updated where you don't have any more boot loop uh, problems. You'll be able to restart and reboot your phone without having to hit the up volume button or anything like that. Uh, it's just totally working. It's ready for prime time. Uh, we have the Pangu app there, and we'll be able to install Cydia, as well as in settings. Uh, we'll be able to have all of our sign-in features like a touch ID and passcode, your iCloud, your iTunes store, you can have auto lock put on and it won't really matter. Everything works now. And all the uh, tweaks or some of the tweaks that show in settings are starting to show up now and everything is working great. We're going to do this very easy and I'm going to show you how to do it. So let's get started. First thing you want to do is you want to hook up your iPhone to the uh, USB lightning cable to open up iTunes and do a full restore, a factory reset of your iOS device. It will set up as new and will be ready to go. The only thing you're going to do on your device now is you're going to hook into your Wi-Fi uh, location services, but cancel everything else out. Agree to the terms and don't set up Touch ID, don't create a passcode, and uh, you could use Siri, and don't send any info to Apple. Standard view, and we get started. So we don't have anything signed in, no iTunes Store, no Touch ID, no nothing. Now on your Windows computer, go to pangu.io, download Pang Pangu Installer, and the Pangu Installer uh, will allow you to get it on your device. And we'll let that download. And now it's downloaded. We'll just click on it. You don't have to do right click administrator. Take the check marks off the question marks and hit the blue button and install. Your iOS device is hooked up via cable to your Windows computer. And we'll let that install the Pango. This is great because we don't have to SSH, we don't have to use CyberDuck or any other SSH client to put the Cydia files on. It's all included now in the Pango. So we'll let that respring. Okay, we're done with the Windows computer. Close everything out and now we have our iOS device. We're still just going to pop through, not going to start up anything, and we have Pango. Now Pango has in, uh, Cydia installed. Boom, install it right in there. Respring your device. Now it's resprung, and we have Cydia. We'll let Cydia open for the first time. We'll let it load up. and it will automatically close and respring or reboot. And now we can open up and we have our Cydia ready to go. One more thing, we have to allow Cydia to open and refresh for changes. And you're gonna see complete upgrade. Let's hit the complete upgrade and we'll put the new Cydia installer on as well as the new Pangu. We'll let that do its thing restart, a reboot, and once it's done rebooting, Cydia is totally ready to go. 
There was no hard uh, SSH with CyberDuck. You didn't have to throw any files in. And now there'll be no more boot loops because everything's been updated. We won't have to press the volume up or do anything like that. So now we're back on our home screen and we can open Cydia and there it is, all ready to go. So now we can go into settings and we could set up our iCloud uh, with the keychain, passcode, find my iPhone, iTunes store ID, touch ID, passcode, and auto lock. Everything just works perfect. Set up your finger scan and see here, everything is there. And now I'm going to show you, we're going to do a full restart and we'll be able to have no problems booting back into our iOS device. And we have Cydia. We'll let that restart. Let's power it on. The big apple turns into the little apple. That's how you know it worked. And there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. All done. Let's type in our passcode. Let's close it. And let's use the finger ID. Boom, done, we're in, everything works. And there we have Cydia, enjoy your untethered jailbreak. Make sure you subscribe and like the video. And I'll show you tweaks that other fear to show you.